What Incredible did you movie. Think? It's very disturbing. Is it bad for kids? Is it bad for would kids you, to see? Yeah, it would well, be. No, because it's the truth and it's what a lot of kids in, in are doing in America. So you liked it? Yeah. It's very upsetting, but yeah. the truth hurts. the week in rock. Photographer Larry Clark made an unusual name for himself in the early 60s with his startling photographs of drug and gun-loving young people on a handbasket to hell. Now at the age of 52, Clark has made the most startling movie of the year. His first, called Kids, a chronicle of one day and night in the lives of a group of New York City teenagers as they party, hang, and generally do the things the kids have always done, including, of course, talking about and seeking sex. There's no nudity in kids and only one fight scene, but while an innuendo-drenched slaughter fest like True Lies, the Schwarzenegger hit, described as a nice little family film, film by moral custodian Bob Dole gets the go-ahead from Hollywood with an R rating, Kids was offered a kiss of death NC-17 by the industry's anonymous ratings gods. But Clark and his producers and screenwriter Harmony Corrine, the New York skateboarding kid who wrote the script when he was 19, turned that offer down and have sent the movie out unrated, which means, depending on the mores of the town where it plays, that the film's prime audience, kids themselves, may actually get to see it. Here's the story. <laughs> What is it with these kids today? That's the question asked and answered by Kids, the debut film by celebrated photographer Larry Clark from a script by New York skateboarder Harmony Corrine, who was 19 when he wrote it. Following a group of friends through an aimless summer day in Manhattan, Kids is so unflinchingly accurate that it was offered only a dreaded NC-17 rating, meaning that the audience that would most appreciate it, kids themselves, wouldn't see it. I mean, you look at all these movies that are out a million times more violent, you know, uh, you know, there's like one fight in the movie, you know, I mean, and, and, and there's no nudity, you know, you know, I mean, it's just things are suggested, it, it just looks too real for them, I think. They don't want to believe that kids have sex, that kids have fun, you know, that kids can, uh, you know, be out on their own and have their own world. Come on, come swimming. So that's your new girl, huh? I hope so for now. You like them kind of young, right? <laughs> I like them new, not like you. <laughs> Kids has created a sensation wherever it's been shown. At the Cannes Film Festival, for instance, where Clark and Corrine were in attendance. It was the hottest ticket in town. No, you know, I mean, I mean, it was, I mean, it was obvious. you couldn't get a seat, but uh, uh, but we got some tickets, right? You know, because because and we, we saw this, the movie. And we saw this one pregnant lady faint online. She wasn't. She fainted online. <laughs> it was crazy. She wasn't wearing underwear. <laughs> In creating this fly-on-the-wall chronicle of teen sex and high spirits, director Clark, who's 52, learned a few things himself. And no one using condoms, man, you know. I know you kids ain't using condoms out there, you know, and it's, you know, you, you know, you know, as Dylan says, you can play with fire, but you'll get the bill. And what do viewers make of this movie? Well, here's one response from an early screening that's entirely typical. Well, it's an incredible movie. It's very disturbing. Is it bad for kids? Is it bad for would kids you, to see? Yeah, well, no, because it's the truth and it's what a lot of kids in, in are doing in America. So you liked it? Yeah. It's very upsetting, but yeah. the truth hurts. Kids is already play, playing in 15 cities across the country. It's opening this weekend in Sacramento, Kansas City, Hartford, Providence, and New Haven. You try to sneak in and see it. As for Madonna, she's now recording two new tracks for her greatest ballads album due out by Christmas.